Alright guys, we have a whole bunch of new animatronics to look at. Well, actually, I think there's only four more. We've already done one. We did Monty the Monkey, but we have four more to look at so far for 2022 from Spirit Halloween. But what I'm going to do in this video here is something that I've been waiting to do, and that's open this awesome mystery box from Spirit Halloween. I told you to stay away! Okay, since this is about Experiment 1031, the very first thing we need to do before we even unbox it is to go to the Spirit Halloween page on YouTube, their own channel, and we're going to watch the Experiment 1031 video, which I have not watched yet, so this will be interesting. Alright, here we go. Is this thing on? Don't waste the battery in that thing. I am documenting our research. It's like research. a found footage Duh. video. Look at this place. Okay, let me just say real quick before we even go any farther. This is really cool to me because, like, up in the corner, it says June 5th, 1994. You got the SP, which is a certain speed on VHS, if you don't know. And the play button up here at the top, um, that's all VHS. So, like, this is like a found footage thing where they're carrying one of those bigger um, video cameras for VHS. And, and that really touches home with me because I used to run around in the 90s filming on one of those. It's Creep City in here. Can you see where I'm going? Ah! What was that? What is it? You okay? Something grabbed at me. You hear singing. Is it freezing in here? What the? <laughs> Nothing's working! Okay, they're flashing some things in front of us here. Emily, turn around! <laughs> Run! Oh, I bet you that's young Crouchy. <laughs> <laughs> Is that Ophelia? We're going to die here, Matt. Every time we go down a hallway, we get more lost. This place isn't normal! <laughs> Come on, go! Pumpkin Reaper, maybe? I don't know if this stuff is all new that they're putting I don't know in yet, here, but... Maybe it will help us get out of here. Give me your notebook. Here, take this. When did you sketch these? The first night. You finally fell asleep, so I thought I... These are really good. Thanks. I sketches of Crouchy, yeah. I guess that is. I just need a few minutes. I almost got it. Okay, okay. Yeah, Emily? Like Emily? <laughs> Who the heck is that? Nah. Whoever Wait it is, it, she got Get him. Up. It's all running. Good. Matt, turn on your recorder. Did you hear that? <laughs> that was pretty Matt, cool, that neck thing. I told him we should stay together. These must all be new animatronics. I, I would be screaming louder than that if I saw that clown. Okay, I, I really don't know what to make out of that, except for there was a lot of stuff in there that looked like new animatronics. So I'm sure we'll get to that in the near future. Meanwhile, let's get back to the box. I actually got this box a couple weeks ago, and I just haven't had the chance to open it yet. And I wasn't going to do that unless I did it in front of you guys. So let's get down to it. You can see where on the front it says J Reber Laboratories. <laughs> Spirit Halloween, Specimen 1031, 22 grams, that's written really small. Test sample, technician, Dr. Illum, date 060666. That's kind of scary. And then down here it says, created in undisclosed location, ingredients, 
contact the manufacturer for a complete list of ingredients. All right, handle with care. Ingredients are volatile. Some elements may produce feelings of panic, excitement, curiosity, or frustration. Use at your own risk. I'm ready. It also says you may experience a slight elevation in heart rate when opening the box. No students or researchers were harmed while making this project. So, let's go ahead and get this open here. Oh, 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 oh. This looks pretty cool. All right, look at this. That's what I see when I first open the box. I love all this black looking like Easter grass. I guess it's Halloween grass, but it looks like Easter grass. And what do we have here? Wait, we have a little pack, J Reaper Laboratories Research Kit. All right, we'll get to that in a second. Let me see what this is. Spirit Halloween. Okay, thank you for volunteering for our student research program. We look forward to you arriving at our facilities this fall. As a reminder, we prepared the contents of this box and selected its ingredients exclusively for you based on your unique chemistry, individuality, and affiliation. We do not recommend sharing them as their use may produce undesired reactions from others, including but not limited to mania, loss of hearing, confusion, <laughs> monsterism, electrical, electrical tribulation, and other sensations. For further information and instructions, please visit spirithalloween.com slash experiment 1031. Okay, so let's get down to this. I gotta see what's in here. First off, J Reaper Laboratories, and it looks like a pencil bag like you'd take to school. Let's go ahead and see what's in here. Holy crap, it's a pencil bag. <laughs> okay, there is literally a pencil in there. That's actually pretty cool though. J Reaper Laboratories, that's funny. A pencil in the pencil bag. All right, what's next? Oh, all right, we got a mini composition book. That's hilarious how it actually says J Reaper on it. That is too funny. All right, there's nothing in there. That's for taking notes and doing research. Then we have Hmm, okay, a little blue charger cable. This is gonna be interesting. We have, ah, oh, this is cool, a stamp. And it says J Reaper, so after you do your research, stamp it. And, all right, hold on, oh, we got, <laughs> we got a little uh, ruler in there, that's hilarious. I'm using that thing, man. And what is this, okay. Wow, that's some small lettering. Laboratory sample ingredients. And it says sugar, corn syrup, gum, arabic, artificial flavor, blah, blah, blah. Um, I didn't see anything to munch on in there, so I'm not sure what that's about. Personal experimental listening device. Okay. All right, that must be referring to... The next thing that we have here, which is a pair of headphones. Hold on. They're kind of buried in here in the black Halloween grass. Yeah. Oh, sweet. Look at that. We got Jack the Reaper on the end. That is pretty cool. Headphones with Jack the Reaper. All right. Wow. <laughs> okay, so apparently they're Bluetooth headphones too. How cool is that? Turn on Bluetooth in your chosen personal listening device. Um, it's all about how to hook it up. Okay, all right. Bluetooth listening device. Let's see if there's anything else in there. Because it does have this sample ingredients thing. Is that a sticker? No, I thought it was maybe a sticker, but anything else in here? Oh, there is. What is it? It's a test tube. This says 1031, and it has what looks like Red Hots in there. I don't know if you guys have ever had the candy called Red Hots, but that's what it is. All right, let's try one. Look, it even has a little uh, cork in it. Where do you put the cork when you put a cork in it? Who can tell me what movie that's from? All right, here we go. A little red, red hot, it looks like. Let's give it a taste. That's exactly what it is, too. It tastes like cinnamon. It's like hot cinnamon in there. That is pretty cool. Yummy. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm going to sift through here. It appears that's everything in here. 
That was a pretty cool little pack. Thank you, Spirit Halloween, for including me in the Experiment 1031 Research Facilities. <clears throat> wow, I need a drink. Hold on. Stay tuned, guys, because right after I get done making this video, I'm going to go back to looking at the new animatronics and get those up for you, too. And don't forget, I will be at the flagship store grand opening on July 30th in Egg Harbor Township, New Jersey. All right, I'll see you in a bit. I told you to stay away! Oh, my God! <laughs> what are you